My name is Miranda Wiklund Miranda. I'm a student from Stockholm and I am here to represent Sweden in the international competition Stockholm right. Junior Water Prize. And yourself? My name is Anna Lindbeck and I'm also representing Sweden in the Stockholm Junior Water Prize. Okay. And yourself? My name is Joanna Blasner and I'm in Myra and Anna's group, so we're one big team. Cool. Yes. Um, <laughs> so what is the main project that you're doing here uh, for the prize? Uh, we're doing a simulation, mm -hmm. which is uh, a sort of role play, mm -hmm. uh, and it's about the Baltic Sea. Mm -hmm. And what's the idea behind that? How? Um, we thought that it is important to know about the Baltic Sea, mm -hmm. and that people want uh, that people want to study and learn about the Baltic Sea. And uh, studying about the Baltic Sea um, is very heavy uh, literature. So we wanted to make a game that changed that and um, mm -hmm. uh, inspired and uh, uh, inspired to learn more about the Baltic Sea and uh, raise awareness. Okay. Do you think that a game would be more fun to get people to learn about Baltic Sea? Um, we we yeah we, we think so and we hope that uh, after playing our game you have the energy and you have the inspiration to to dig deeper into these ocean. Okay, issues. and how do you make it more fun then? Well, by, um, by engaging the people to uh, actively take part and uh, play a part in the role and uh, then... Um, they yeah. have to be active in the learning yes, process. Exactly. They can't just sit back and listen to the teacher. Yes. They have to think for themselves and imagine how would I react in this situation mm -hmm. and what am I going to do now. It, it raises a curiosity. Okay. Maybe questions like, is, is this really how it happens in real life, or yeah. should it be like this? Yeah. So, for instance, if everybody can d just tell me, um, who are the stakeholders in this game? Okay. All right. Yes, we have one game leader that mm. um, presents new scenarios. Yeah. There are three di different scenarios where mm. new things happen, mm -hmm. and then there are um, there are farmers, uh, mm. agri agriculturists, uh, fishermen, and organizations. Mm -hmm. And uh, do the, are they from different nations represented? Yes, um, the, uh, it's five countries, and in every country there's farmers, uh, fishermen, and uh, organization people. Okay. Yeah. All right. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Hope you understood it. Yeah.